Hi guys, so today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to reuse an old container. And I'm using this container, it's filled with chocolate. And, um, it's chocolate, it's Belgium chocolate. Um, it's Belgium milk chocolate, and it was so good. Um, so, um, you will need, like, wet paper towels, or wet toilet paper, or wet towels, um, or anything like that, and, and, um, yeah, or you could use some disinfecting wipes, um, I have that, so I'm going to use that instead, so I'm using Lysol, um, kills 99 point nine per ninety nine point ninety nine percent of viruses and bacteria disinfecting wipes tough cleaning powder thick strong wipe and um yeah so I think it's really good so um it's just all about cleaning the container well so you wanna remove all the contents of the um, container like here my container has these and I'm going to reuse them because these could be useful um so over here you can see in the corners um there's chocolate I'm going to take some wipes and I'm just going to clean the container. So, um, I think it's that I say. Yeah, okay. So, just clean it. Wipe the container well. Anything is useful. Um People who just have creative minds tend to use things, tend to figure out some ways um, on how it could be useful and how um, you could use them. They seem to be more resourceful than people who are less creative because they can think of more things, how they could reuse stuff. Um, and, um, yeah. So just nicely wipe the container and um, when you're done, just wait for it to air dry. Air dry is good because um, all of the scents kind of just... Android, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but I like it better when it's air drying. So just kind of wipe your container. So um, make sure to wipe the outsides also. So that, um, if the container is, like, see-through, like mine, um, you might think that there's still dirt inside the container when it's just on the outside. So, just want to clean that. Okay. And just let that air dry. Then take the contents of the container, like, if you have something like this. You just want to clean that also so that it's free of any... Um, like chocolate or something like that. Okay. 
Look at that, it's nice and ready to use and it's clean. Mm -hmm. Now let's put aside to air dry in the next container. And then you're done. So for scents, if you like them to smell really good, um, I would recommend just taking some scented hand sanitizers or scented fragrances. Um, scented hand sanitizers are good because they also disinfect. Um, so yeah, let me try the next scenting one. So this is Pink Sugar Plum, and this is by Bath and Body Works. <clears throat> now I'm just going to put one drop of hand sanitizer on it, so that it's nice and scented. It smells really good. Move on to, and let that air dry. Excuse me. If your box or thing is kind of worn out, um, you just want to glue everything back together, tape stuff, um, until you think that it's all good. So let that air dry, and if you'd like, you could decorate it. So you could like cover the container with some deck, like patterned duct tape. That looks really nice. Also, you could add sequins or beads. You could paint stuff on it. I just like my container just the way it is. It's fine like that. Um. So I'm just going to leave it the way it is, um, but it's your choice, you could decorate yours however you like. Um, I know um, a good channel where she um, um, shows you how to decorate certain containers, um, I'll put the link in the description if you'd like. I still have to find her channel, so I'll put it in the description um, whenever I can, um, once I find her channel, because... Um, yeah, so you know, I think her user, YouTube username is Nikki the Brat, so, um, N-I-K-K-I the Brat, um, so go to YouTube.com slash Nikki the Brat, I don't know what the exact URL is for a channel, so, I don't know, but I do think her, um, username is Nikki the Brat. She she has wonderful DIYs also, and you should really check her channel out. So, um, yeah. So, mine seems to be dry, alright. Smells really nice. And, um, so, I like, I like to put, um, some of my bracelets in here. Um, you could also, um, put your hand sanitizers in there, because I know I have no room to put my hand sanitizers, I just put them on the floor beneath my desk, and, yeah. Um, what is that other, um, one? And I know you can mix stuff in this. Um, you could use this as mold. And this, you can mix something in here. So, I like to keep these. So, 
So yeah, that's just a little short tutorial video on how to reuse your containers. Um, just clean them really nicely, and then you're ready to go decorate them however you like. Um, I do like the idea of taking some um, tie-dye boondoggle and just wrapping it around. Um, but of course, it's going to be um, decorated more than that. But tie it around the box, and if you can, um, make a little ribbon. That would be nice also. Um, I really like that idea. You just get a strip of the um, tie-dye and just glue that on, or tape it, however you'd like. Um, and stuff like that. So just be creative and have fun. Thanks for watching this video.